Another common occurrence that leads to elder abuse charges is neglect and endangerment. This is where you have a duty to take care of a senior person, but you abandon that person and that abandonment causes them harm. Now to be charged as a crime, you have to have had more than just a moral duty. You have to have breached a legal duty. I'll give you an example. Suppose you have a grandmother who lives alone in the next town. She becomes incapacitated, so she can't go and get her medicine, and consequently she dies. Now maybe you had a moral duty. Maybe you should have been over there checking on her more often and been more of a presence in her life. But that alone is not going to get you charged with a crime. Now change the facts. Suppose you live with your grandmother. Suppose you get a stipend from Social Security to look after her and take care of her. And she relies on you to go to the pharmacy and get her medicine. But you go on vacation for a couple of weeks and she doesn't get her meds and consequently she dies. In that situation, you could be charged with the crime of elder abuse based on a theory of neglect and endangerment. 